Well, in these days, well, there are a lot of public clouds, and people don't want to be bound to one particular public cloud provider. And so interoperability will hopefully make it easier to migrate from one public cloud to another. On the flip side, we now have a lot of internal clouds being built where people have their private cloud in their own data center. But sometimes you want to spill over out of your own private data center into a public cloud because you have increased load. And that's where having interoperability makes it a lot easier to do that. Delta Cloud is our way to try to abstract away the differences or the deltas in all the cloud uh, providers that are out there. So we're trying to provide a unified interface that allows you to address internal clouds or external clouds like Amazon and Maso and these other clouds. The goal is to make it where you don't have to think too much about the cloud provider you're targeting, when that you can be working towards an internal cloud and do a spillover into a public cloud, or maybe you can just migrate from one public cloud to another public cloud. And in general, it should simplify your, your, your coding and how you deploy against all these different facilities. I'm Bob McCorder. I'm with uh, JBoss. I'm in the research and prototyping group, so we get to go and experiment with cool things and see what shakes out. Well, right now, it's, it's pretty early in the, uh, the, the stage of development for clouds, and everyone has their own way of doing things. They're all doing about the same thing, but they do it differently. And so by trying to erase those differences, it should just make it easier for uptake for the, the end user in the long term. Well, so far, we have basically instance management. We, we haven't dealt with images as far as the virtual machines you load into the clouds. But you can start virtual machines in any cloud, and you can drop them down in any cloud that we support using the exact same commands and the, the same API. We certainly want to expand on Delta Cloud and uh, make the, the REST API cover more of the, the facilities there, whether it's uh, queuing services or simple databases or basically any facility that is offered in the various clouds. So the community today so far with uh, Delta Cloud, we're launching it today, and we uh, will welcome anyone who wants to come in and start working with us and, and help flesh it out. So if you want to pitch in, just come to deltacloud.org and there we'll have our wiki and information about the API and where you can contribute.